Sunnis is formed by a group of scientists that work on a number of different items and especially in the field of newly emerging infections and especially virus infections but also neglected infectious diseases. When we are talking about emerging diseases, emerging infections, yeah, we realize that we are being confronted with for instance avian flu, MERS, SARS, uh, chikokunya, Zika, tick-borne encephalitis, just to mention a few. And most, if not all, of these viruses, they spill over from the animal world. And we are working on these, these infections from the perspective of one health, meaning that human and animal health and the environment are very closely interconnected. So that means that we are studying both the animal side and the human side, but on top of that also we look at environmental factors, for instance, that influence these infections and predispose for their emergence. The question of course is why is Artemis unique? We have discovered quite a number of these newly emerging infections, for instance different uh, avian influenza viruses, SARS, MERS, we were all at the basis of the discovery of those viruses. So on the one hand we have discovered these viruses, but on the other hand also once they emerge and they cause problems in society, we work on intervention strategies. And when I say intervention strategies, I mean rapid detection, but also we have worked on intervention strategies like the development of vaccines, the development of antivirals, just to be able to very rapidly control these new things when they emerge. So like today, we are facing a problem, a big problem with Zika virus infection. So immediately we focus our attention on that one as well. And the way we are doing that is on the one hand offering our own expertise, using our own expertise, but we really do that in a network of international collaboration under, so to say, one roof. And in addition to that, we are collaborating also with the best scientists in the world in European projects, in international projects being funded by all kinds of different international organizations. So taking all these things together, I think we are very well positioned to tackle these problems for the future and really to be well prepared for the future.